Now, this is a simple tutorial for balancing of equations. This is a very basic balancing lesson. Here is the example that we have chosen. A reaction between methane, a gas, with oxygen, a gas, giving you carbon dioxide, a gas, and water vapor at the time of formation of the products. Now what we have to do next in order to do a simple balancing is write the elements that we are planning to balance on the left side. I have written carbon, hydrogen, oxygen. Similarly on the right side, carbon, hydrogen, oxygen. The next thing to do is count the atoms on the left and the right. We have one carbon on the left and one carbon on the right. Four hydrogens on the left and two hydrogens on the right. So we have to balance hydrogen. Oxygen we have two on the left and three on the right. But the question is, which element do we balance first? The simple rule is, if there are elements that forms more than one compounds in the product side, that should be balanced last. So in this case, if you look at oxygen, it forms carbon dioxide and water. Both the products have oxygen. Therefore, balance oxygen last. And if you look at carbon and hydrogen, they both form a single compound. Carbon changes into carbon dioxide and hydrogen changes into water. Therefore, you can start with either. Now, since this reaction is a combustion reaction involving hydrocarbons, I would prefer starting with carbon, going to hydrogen, and finally with oxygen. Now, if you look at the number of carbon atoms, there is one on the left and one on the right. So we don't have to make any changes there. For hydrogen, we have four hydrogens on the left and two hydrogens on the right. So what we're going to do is multiply or add a coefficient for water molecule, which is two. So we have totally four hydrogen atoms. Now, if you count oxygen atoms, there are two in carbon dioxide and two in water, which means we have four oxygen atoms on the right side. In order to make the oxygen atoms equal, you want to add a two in front of the oxygen in the reactant side. So now we have four oxygens. Now the equation is balanced. That's the way you balanced a simple equation.